In this tutorial, let's see what is a cut set. A cut set is a set of uh, a set of all the vertices, all the edges. Okay, we'll be partitioning all the edges into two different sets, into two different sets, it's such that they are named as branches and chords. So that each cut set always contains only one single branch, and rest may be edges. So I think everyone is clear with the definition. Let us go through the definition once again. A cut set is the partition of all the edges into two different sets. Into two different sets such that each cut set individually has a single branch and any number of chords. So let us grow, go through an example. Let us take an example like this. V1, V2, V3, V4, V5, A6, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H and I. Okay, I think we've drawn it perfect. So, let us take the minimum number of edges between them. So, I'll be, initially I'll be plotting the dots Okay, for any kind of diagram follow this method, this will be the best method. So this is the one, two, three, let us take like this or, okay, that's fine. Like this, like this, okay. This is a possible diagram in which I have covered all the vertices. Three, V2, V5, V4, V6. I think I have covered all the vertices. Yeah, every vertice is similar in both the diagrams. So, I'll be writing these branches. Let's, let us take the edges A, B, C, F, G, H. So, all these will be coming under branches. Branches is equals to set of all this B, C, F, G, H. H and all the rest are chords. Missing elements are A. This is B, sorry D. This is E, D, E and I. Okay. So these are the missing. So they are chords. So now whenever we are trying to find the cut set so we'll be considering I think everyone is clear with the initial definition in which I have told you clearly that there should be exactly a single branch a single branch and any number of chords this is the condition so it is clear that branches are B C F G H so this is a branch and here when I'll be trying to draw it v1 there is only a single branch so here a cut vertex is possible let us assume this as one and again at v2 similar case c is the single branch so here also it is possible let us assume this as two and when we will be trying to draw it v3 we are already having b c f all these three are branches so at v3 it is not possible okay now when we will be trying for this F, we can directly draw a cut set like this. So that it is passing through a single branch that is F. Okay, so this will be our third one. And when we will be trying to draw it V4, the same situation like this, we will be having two. So it is not possible at V4. And we can draw like this for this edge, we can draw like this. Yes, this will be the fourth one. And for H, we can draw like this. This will be the fifth one. And for sixth V6, we can actually draw like this. As there is only a single branch, this will be the sixth one. 
so now we'll be writing them in terms of sets okay I'll be writing them down here clearly the first one first one we are having a common branch that is B and a single chord A for the second one we are having the branch C and we are having two chords both A and D it is nothing but whenever it is nearer there is a path between these both and that is A and this both that is D so these two will be the chords and this is the branch similarly for third one we are passing like this F will be the branch and E and D will be the chords next for the fourth one it is like this so it is passing through G so G is the branch and rest of the single it is I and I is the chord fifth it is passing through H and it also has the same chord I sixth it is like this so sixth we are having H as the branch and I as the chord so all these six are the cut sets for this graph I think everyone is clear with this topic thank you for watching if there is any confusion or any doubts you can comment down so that I'll try to help you all. Thank you.